<clears throat> Alright guys, so I'm just doing some follow-ups on this pistol here. I did film some like post-shooting videos and, and talked about how well it performs after being broken in and everything. Yeah, so even though I made a video saying that the PMC sucked through it, you know, once it's broken in it kind of basically starts working pretty good, but every once in a while you'll still get a hang, so I, I still don't recommend it, but it will work, so unlike the other video that I made, PMC does work. But I, the main thing I wanted to talk about is um, something that's completely not out there yet, and at least not that I've seen that I've been searching for a while, is some holsters for this model. This right here that I got, it came with the FN because FN was having a promo that if you bought the pistol, or any FN pistol basically, you would get a free concealment holster. And you know what they had given me though in the package was something pretty cool. They gave me like a little hat for Safari Land, a little magazine clip. I don't really use it too much, it's kind of tight and of course the holster but there wasn't anything for this model but you can see that this one's fitting and it actually works really really cool really well so I just wanted to tell you how I went about getting that to fit and everything so basically the the holster that it comes with is this one it's a the duty gear concealment holster part number 5199-266-411 yeah it, this is basically meant for just the FN S9 without the long slide, it's just the standard model. So yeah, because it was for the the standard model, I had to do some modifications for it to work. Over here, let's see if you get this holster off. This kind of tapered in into a close, and it kind of just wrapped around where the barrel would be on the nine normally, about right there. And all I did is I basically just dremeled out to where where this piece here closed up, basically where I left this kind of curved lip here, so that way it would still hold on to this section of the gun right here and basically anything that was blocking this from going through I dremeled away and it, there's a specific measurement to that too let me get my multimeters here so I basically dremeled it away until there was this much space in between it oh wait let me re-zero this out I need to do it should have been prepared for this video guys but I don't know not really that prepared. Okay, so I think it was like 8 point, yeah, 0.825 exactly, the um, the measurement for for this gap right here. And basically what I did is I just dremeled it out until I had that gap, or even a little bit more. I think I'm at like 8.3 or something here. I mean 0.83 or 0.84. But yeah, I tried to get it exact, but I just kind of got tired of dremeling and just made it bigger. But basically you make that opening right here, you know, 0.8. Two five um, width or whatever inside, and that'll allow the, just the tip, the extra inch of the, that barrel, to fit through there. And there's like the slightest, tiniest little bit of gap on um, on each side. But the the cool thing about this holster is that they have this little imprint here that basically is what holds the gun in place um, against the little trigger guard here. So other than that, it's it's actually a really nice holster. I don't really, I'm not really too fond of it too much. I don't like to use it because it can't be really concealed because when you know you're wearing it on your belt right here, it kind of sticks out like this far. You know, I'm more used to my, the Kydex ones that I've made that sit pretty much flush with my body. So, but th this thing's really cool. It comes with an Allen wrench so you can adjust the retention level. I don't want to really mess with it because I have it set perfect to where it holds really nice. It's hard to pull out unless I'm at the range or something and I pull it out myself. It's, it's like dialed in perfect. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of go over that on, on how you can go about getting a Safari Land concealment holster for the FNS 9 long slide and how to go about getting it to fit. Yeah, I mean, you could have basically dremeled all this down and made that flush too, but I didn't want to mess with the stitching and it kind of looks a little cool with that little round poke there, I guess. But anyway, yeah, everything works good. It works smooth. The, the sight doesn't get caught on this at all you know when you pull it out it goes right into place where it needs to be like right there Let's see if I can focus this it goes right where it needs to be right there and yeah that's it so if you guys want a holster like right now before a lot of the other holsters even come out because there's I haven't found any holsters online for this gun anyway definitely just buy one of those buy this model here and then just do the modification yourself you actually probably like it a lot I, I really do like this this um, holster a lot whenever like I'm shooting with it but as far as carrying no not it's not for me it's too 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 wide I guess comes off the body too much for me yeah that's it I think it looks pretty cool with the little barrel coming out anyway so that's it guys there, that's how you can go about getting a, a holster for your FNS long slide so hope that uh, helps a lot of people out there I know that I've been reading a bunch of forums where people have been searching and searching for for a holster 
and they can't seem to find one. I know that some people do make some that are just kind of like, you know, they're meant for just like long barrel pistols and stuff, but as far as this specific model for the FN, this this one works really, really well. So, And I'm sure you can change this clip style out, maybe make your own little belt clip or something so it sits more flush to the body, but that's up to you. That's it guys, hope you liked the video. I will try and post up that footage, I'm just, like I said, I've been lazy about editing it, of, you know, me shooting this even more. And that's it, I guess. So, have a good one, guys. For shooting video, I kind of have all the footage ready, but I've just been lazy on editing it. Reviews with with it on the... Hey guys, so I just wanted to do some um, follow-up stuff on this pistol. I did do a video review on how it performed after shooting and getting it broken in for a while. And my dog is in the shop. What are you, what are you doing? What are you doing, Pigeon? Thanks for playing. Okay, okay, I need to do my video. Go. Go, you cutie pie. Okay, if you lay right there, you can be in the video. Okay? Alright guys, so I did a follow-up review on this.